What is going on, everybody? It is your boy, John from the Game Duke, here, welcoming you back to some more Danganronpa 2 Goodbye Despair. At the last episode, we finished off Trial 5. Chiaki had was revealed to be the traitor, which is big sad because another one of my favorite characters died. Surprise! It's Danganronpa. If you like a character, they're freaking dying. That is what season two taught me like what's funny is the in the first game like what who we had left were characters i actually enjoyed like biakia uh well as one of them i'm not i don't want to spoil too much because if you haven't played the first game or watched the first game you should do that um even though i have been prone to spoiling things in the past i'll be i'll be better it's fine anyway my, but what i'll say is the characters i actually enjoyed though lasted now this one they all are just dead so we're we're here for it but monokuma said quote quote this is the last that was the last death so do we believe him probably not let's be real but we were told to meet at the restaurant so that's where we will go next and we have a pet to take care of that i said that we didn't want to have a single despair point on this pet and we probably already do so oh we don't look at us go we're, do we're doing good we're doing okay on this pet. Let's see if we can actually make it happen. 10 hope, zero despair? Probably not. Yeah. Hey, you're late. Is it true that Nagito really left another message? <gasps> Kneel before Miss Sonia and thank her. She's the one who found it. <laughs> uh, I was going to walk with Gundam's hamster and I found it when I stopped by the factory. Wait, why does she have one of Gund Gundam's hamsters? Well. Oh, fuck. Gundam was here? What? Huh? Huh? Hmm. A coincidence, you say? Wrong. That is the will of casualty guiding you. Hmm? Why would Missonia be going on a walk with Gundam? I never allowed that. Right. So anyway, let's hurry up and play it. Yeah, you're right. Huh? I'm so confused. Hmm. I wonder who's watching this message. Is it the traitor from the Future Foundation? If so, congratu congratulations. Looks like it ended the way I hoped it would. Ended the way he hoped it would. Nagito was in fact trying to kill everybody except the traitor. Damn it. It was just as Monokuma said. So he really set up the traitor as the killer and then even tried to make them survive the trial? But why would he even do that? Enough of your useless talk. It appears that there's some still more. What? Why are people that, huh? Uh, but if everyone but the traitor is watching this video, then unfortunately, I guess I lost. The outcome is the complete opposite of my hopes that I believe in. Well, not that it matters anymore. I mean, no matter what the outcome is, it didn't matter to a dropout like me. Let's put this meaningless introduction aside and get down to business. Since I don't know who I'm talking to, I'm not going to speak so that both sides... I'm going to speak so that both sides will understand. First of all, you might be wondering why I did what I did. Well, I just took action after talking about it for so long. The special prize in the final dead room allowed me to a certain truth. It would be troublesome if I found out, so... I disposed of that page. But anyway, I was totally surprised. I mean... What? Ah, the Future Foundation's traitor must have known the truth all along. And so I was able to learn the truth about this world and resolved to take action immediately. Ah, I shouldn't have made fun of Hayame, but deep down, I always wanted to be the protagonist myself. What the... Ah, but now that I know the truth, I, as I look back on Monokuma's actions, I'm starting to see what he's planning. By giving us the information about the island's mystery and the future foundation, he's raising all of your hopes. So that he can lead you to an unimaginable despair. Plus, 
Monica was trying to show that despair to someone. Perhaps that someone is. Ah, oh, what a hopeless truth. Who is Monokuma's true identity? How could they pull up with a plan like that? But that's not enough. That's enough reflecting on the past. Let's talk about the future now. If you want to escape Monokuma's plan, there's a specific place that you'll need to go. And the key to enter that place is that message you found at Nazimi Castle. Normally, you would follow a bunch of steps to enter that place. But since that message gets rid of those steps, you can think of it as an Easter egg or something. It was probably left by someone other than Monokuma or Monami. But that had nothing to do with me. Oh, I had to hide this until my plan came to an end. But I guess now it's time to announce it, right? So then... I'll announce the password. Oh, ho, ho! oh my god, why didn't I think of that? I didn't. What a dime dumb. I didn't think of that. Bruh. If it's Hope Speak Academy, that makes sense. That's the password that was written in Nazimi Castle. Speaking of references to the first game, <laughs> you have to answer that, that specific password. You have to use that code to enter the specific place, and that's the only way you can escape Monokuma. I feel like I've been talking forever, but that's all for me. With that, my duty is finished. I believe in my actions. I believe my actions will become the foundation of this world's hope. And if that really happens, praise me. Tell others what I've accomplished. Erect a bronze statue of me. Respect me. Please call me the ultimate hope. Oh my god. This was Nagino's final message. Um, um that one one zero three seven number that was Nagino said was the password? There's no mistaking it! Dead's the password to enter the ancient ruin! You better hurry, I think. Let's go before the countdown reaches zero. You're right, let's go. Where would you like to go? What? Uh huh? Wait. What the hell is going on? Now it's not the time to relax. I need to hurry and get to the ancient ruin on the second island. Or I get fast traveled there. Whoa! Huh? This is so weird. Is my pet taking damage right now or something? I need to double check my pet. I'm being super hyper. Oh god, I'm so glad I did. Okay. I'm being hyper focused on my pet, and I understand that, but like also. Um. Somehow, it is quite nerve wracking. Yeah. Is it really safe to go inside? What's gonna be in there? You it's unbelievable to think to be freaked out by that. You're a man, aren't you? <laughs> there is also a countdown. There's no time to stand around. Damn right. This is our last chance to get inside. <laughs> I'm starting to feel nauseous from the thrills and the chills and the kills. Uh, you're gonna let me out. Uh, why not do it in the Tupperware I keep with me? Why not do it in the Tupperware I keep with me? What? Hey, now's not the time to fuck around. Uh, it's gonna be all right. You don't have to worry. I will protect you, my young master. Now then, let's go move forward together. The hell. Don't treat me like a kid. Believe in the hope that lies beyond this point. That is your leader's orders. What was that? I told you that... I told her that you only understand, understand piggy talk. Uh, I said you're cool at piggy talk going to kill you. The password, please? Yeah, I know. It's gonna be fine. There's no need to worry. The only thing beyond this point is a shining future. Now then, open the door to the future. One. 
Oh, I guess I would never had time to input that anyway. Beyond this door, the future is waiting. A sparkling future. Now then, let's move forward. That's a trial room, what? Is this a trial ground? But why am I at a trial ground? It sure looks like a trial ground, but the vibe is way different than the one from before. Um, by the way... Huh? Um, where did everyone go? Me? Everyone? What? Something's wrong. What did I do? No, that's not it. I'm not the weird one. What's really weird is... This world. This is the big bomb, okay. Stage clear? What? It is so hard because this game is intentional. This is intentional effects. Like, it is intentionally doing this. You've obtained the gamer backpack. The best of the gamer backpack. Would you like to save? Of course. This is crazy already. Like, we're, we're 10 minutes into this, folks. Chapter Zero, heading to the school trip. It would be wrong to say it was swaying from side to side. It's actually shaking rather intensely. The room I was in was shaking from side to side. The shaking was quite irregular. Just when you thought it was a series of small shakes, it would suddenly shake violently. And every time that happened, I'd have to steady myself with my foot. I couldn't stand up very well, but for me, it was comforting. I never thought not knowing what to expect could be fun. So I, I was feeling rather excited. But I figure I get bored the, of that feeling soon enough, and that's what I was expecting. For me, a person who lo is loved by talent, detecting regularities among irregularities won't be that difficult. How boring. Whoa! It's Nagido. Do you like ships? On the other side of the dark room, I heard a voice. Oh, Nagito's the other voice. It was clearly directed at me. <laughs> you look like you were having fun, so that's what I assume. Do you like ships? You do like ships, right? Ships? Ah, oh, that's right. That's it. So this is a ship. Ha ha ha. You just realized that now? Is it really that funny? Hey, if you want care to talk a little? The silence is starting to bore me. Instantly, I saw his true character. The over-familiar attitude, the friendly smile. But under that skin, I detect a foul offensive odor, odor, like some kind of putrid slime. In a sensible way, of course. How could I put this? It was a small exclusive to those who were already finished. Nice to meet you. I'm Nagido Komida. Anyway, lucky me. It has been a while since anyone was willing to talk to me. So to share a room with a person like that? Yep. I'm definitely lucky. Lucky. Ah, so that's your talent then. Ugh, what a boring talent. Ah, uh, a boring talent, huh? Well, that's exactly what it is. 
But for someone I am meeting for the first time to say it so suddenly, it's because I have luck as well, huh? Even I possess a talent as boring as luck. Possess, huh? I'm starting to get really interested. Who are you? You're obviously from Hope's Peak Academy as well, right? You're one of us? Ah, uh, but that's weird. This is the first time I've ever seen you. Hey, can you tell me why you're here? How did you end up here? How boring. Ah, uh, sorry. I'm often told I'm terrible at making conversation. Not you. This world, huh? This world is full of boring people. People who lack talent to stick together and oppress those who do, who do possess talent. Even though they know they're insignificant, they don't try and acknowledge their true superiors. They are profoundly desperate to drag them down to their level. And because of that, these bastards, this or because of these bastards, this world has become an, or has come to deadlock. The world has stopped evolving. How boring. Uh, well, the world is shaped by the will of the majority, so it makes sense that it bends to those who lack talent. That's why we're in our present situation. Uh, perhaps does that have anything to do with the reason you're here? Boring people have make no contributions to the world. Not even a speck of dust. That is why my teachers taught me, or that's why my teachers taught me that. A certain degree of selection must be performed. <sighs> it looks like they had high expectations for you, huh? That's completely different from me. Uh, but what are you planning to do? Now that you've ended up like this, there's nothing you can do, right? Listen well, using people is a talent too. It is now my turn to use that person, just as they used me in the past. That person? Are you talking about the ultimate despair? But how? I mean, they're already... I have it with me. The contribution that person left to me, even now, rests in my pocket. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm definitely lucky. I cannot believe I'm speaking to someone as amazing as you. Then, will I be able to see her again? Will I be able to see the person that I hate with every fiber of my being again? And this time, will I be able to kill her this time? The person I hate so, so much. Hate. Then explain your hand. Ah, uh, this. The end of that bandage. Why does... Huh? Huh? At the end of the bandage is a woman's hand, right? <laughs> Isn't it amazing? I can't move it, of course. I mean, it's not my hand after all. But even now, it still hasn't rotted. Maybe that means it's becoming one with me. Isn't it amazing? I have successfully become one with the ultimate despair. My sworn enemy. That's what I thought. Wasn't that Junko's hand because the fake nails and everything what I see so you salvage the body you really are a boring person uh, I don't want you to misunderstand I just see her as my enemy you know because she is my sworn enemy because I hate her so much that's why I took her power and for that, I... Wait, huh? Do I hate her? Huh? That's strange. Huh? Ha 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 Ah, look out the window. We're finally here. Ah, you're starting to see it too, right? That Jabberwock... That's Jabberwock Island, isn't it? Ah, isn't it exciting? I wonder what's going to happen on this island once we get here. What's going to happen? I can already predict what will happen. Huh? I already know because I I am loved by my talent. But no matter what happens, it is no concern to me. I will not be able to participate in what lies ahead. Hmm? Really? I don't really understand, but... I guess we have to part ways for a while. That's disappointing. Seem to be getting along pretty well. Hey, maybe I can see you again. There's no reason we'll ever meet again. After all, you are boring.
Your talent, your thoughts, your entire existence is boring to me. Ah, you really don't play along, do you? What is this? It's a door. There's a door. Huh? A door. Why is there a door here? Where am I? How did I get here? What am I supposed Where am I supposed This is... Okay, this, this is weird, because this is exactly how they looped the first game in. I'm so nervous right now. Huh? Isn't this a classroom? But even so, that's a very strange classroom. Why am I in a place like this? I went inside the ancient ruin with everyone else. And I arrived at a place that looked like a trial ground. Then, but then why? It's not connecting. I don't know why I'm here. It's like there's no connection between how I left the trial ground and how I ended up here. It's just like before. When we were gathered at the classroom, just before we arrived at Jabberwock Island. But where is this place? Is it somewhere on Jabberwock Island? Ahem, ahem, testing, testing. Mic check, one, two. This is a test of the school broadcast system. Am I on? Can everyone hear me? Okay, well then, welcome to Hope Speak Academy, you guys. At this point, I shall explain the graduation exam to you all. So please assemble at the gymnasium immediately. Huh? Did he, think, did he say what I think he just said? Yes, he definitely said it. Welcome to Hope Speak Academy. But why would a place like this be Hope Speak Academy? And not just that. What is the graduation exam? Isn't, like, the killing over already? We're actually in the school now? Wait a minute, what? Am I about to get a flashback to DR1? Old, oh my god! Even the hallway doesn't feel like a school at all. What a creepy place. At least it doesn't look like a normal school at all. That's definitely a lie. There's no way this place is Hope Speak Academy. This Is this creepy place the Hope Speak Academy that I've admired for so long? Is it... It's probably the building that Monokuma made us made to startle us. Just like the funhouse. No, it's not. That's right, that's definitely it. Monokuma said come to the Judaizi, right? I'll definitely go and clear things up. That's his red trial door that we can't get past. What? Where's the map? I forgot how No, there's the map. This is crazy. This is actually the school. Oh, those are the stairs that wouldn't let us go upstairs. Can I, do I still get access to my pet? I do. I still, I need to check my pet like <laughs> super regularly. The gymnasium is right here. All right, I'm going inside. Something must be waiting, but I'm not going to cower away anymore. I, and I, so I brace myself cautiously and open the door. This is the end. Goodbye, Academy of Despair. I wasn't prepared for what was waiting for me on the other side of that door. It was a normal gymnasium. Damn right. Yo, hi, Ma. Ah, uh, you heard the announcement too, and came right here. You guys did too, right? What's going on? Huh? W what do we make of all this? Monica said this was the place was Hope Speak Academy or something. Got it. That cannot be possible. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. Anyway, any way you look at it, it's impossible. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Hello. How does it feel to return to a long-awaited Hope Speak Academy? You. you. Hey, where are we? 
Where'd you lock us up this time? Ah, oh, what a shock. I just told you guys. This is Hope's Peak Academy. There's no way in hell that's true. No, no. Oh, but it is. I mean, this is definitely Hope's Peak Academy. Well, what's left of it anyway? What's left of it? Uh, didn't I tell you before? Unfortunately, Hope's Peak Academy fell to ruin. Uh, you were serious about that? Cool. Of course it fell to ruin. I mean... They were doing things that were deserved to be ruined for. What do you mean? Uh, anyways, I'm pretty disappointed. I went to all this trouble to bring you back to Hope's Peak Academy, and you don't feel surprised or nostalgic? Uh, oh well. It's not like you guys, it's not like I did it for you guys anyway. Even if you don't feel nostalgic, I'm sure someone is feeling nostalgic right now. Someone? Enough with this bullshit! Just spit it out already! Where'd you take us? Uh, though I'm not concerned in my mem- uh, so, th Although I'm not certain of my memories, I believe we entered the ancient ruin and- in other words, It means I made this Hope's Peak Academy between the door to the ruin and the inside of the ruin. Mm. What do you mean between? Hey, hey, hey. What do you mean made? <sighs> oh my, are your minds getting the grumblies? Is that all the only knowledge you can satisfy? Good, good, very good. It is fine to hurry along to the graduation exam, but it is in my nature to provide a little entertainment first. Entertainment? You're planning on to make us do something, aren't you? No <sighs> it's nothing to be so cautious about. It's not like you'll be making life cha exchanges or anything like that. It's just a simple graduation exam. Then what is the graduation exam? Um, well, as the headmaster, I am conflicted, you know. On one hand, I'm really happy that you're finally able to graduate. But on the other hand, I'm worried about whether you guys will be okay in the outside world. That's why I'm thinking about telling you what the outside world is like before you make your decision. Whether or not you leave Jabberwock Island or stay here. Huh? We're obviously going to get out. There's no way we'd stay here. This is annoying. Just hurry up and let us choose. Let us choose right now. No, no, no. Ah, you can't do that. The main cast hasn't arrived yet. Um, main cast? Hey, um, I mean, you guys are just extras until the guest of honors arrive. So enough complaining and hurry up and start researching the outside world. What do you mean? Uh -huh. I have dispersed all the teaching materials you need for your research throughout Hope's Peak Academy. Well, I don't think this needs to be said, but... All the information is accurate and contains no lies whatsoever. Otherwise, the main cast is going to hate me. So please, rest assured and strive to do your best during this field trip. As usual, after leaving with us his cryptic words, Monokuma disappeared. Even if, he's setting, even if the setting had changed, even if the killing was finished, he was still the same as usual. Um, what is going on? The outside world? Main cast? Somehow I have a bad feeling about this. Like, you kept insisting that this place is Hope's Peak Academy. But that's impossible, right? How do we make it back to Hope's Peak Academy from a tropical island in the first place? It's impossible. There's no place for Hope's Peak Academy to exist on Jabberwock Island. I said I wanted to go back. I don't want to go back to the creepy place like this. What does this mean? So many things I don't understand have happened on this island. This building. Is it really Hope's Peak Academy? This is Hope Peaks Academy. I've been admiring for, for so long. What in the world is going on? Damn it. Why does this keep happening? Why? I was finally able to attend Hope's Peak Academy. I finally thought I'd become confident in myself. Even so, I wanted to become Hope. If that's what you were thinking, just stop it. Listen carefully. The only humans worthy of becoming hope possess amazing talents and strong will. And the moment you are born into this world, you either have one, that or you don't. It has nothing to do with effort. You have been, must have been chosen by hope to become hope. That is why it's not even worth admiring. <sighs> or were you blindfolded by your admiration for Hope Speak Academy that you couldn't even see that? 
You're just some nobody from the Reserve Corps who never had a talent to begin with. A nobody who had forgotten he was a nobody. That's all. If I really am a nobody, then you should have left me alone. Why? Why do I have to go through something like this? Um, Hayame? Did something happen? Huh? Hey, bastard. Now's all the time to zone out. Sorry, it's nothing. Um, I don't really get it, but is that all? As long as I don't beat the crap out of Monokuma, nothing's going to be solved. Is that what this means? Hey. Just what the heck is Monokuma anyway? He's not part of the Future Foundation, right? Um, if you say that, then what is the Future Foundation? Even though Chiaki and Monami are gone, our situation hasn't changed one bit, which means the Future Foundation wasn't our enemy. That's the only thing I can think of. Are you serious? So they're not World Ender? Then we were really tricked by Monokuma. The Future Foundation is responsible for trapping us on this island, right? Regarding the matter, I believe Monami never once denied that. Even if they are our allies, they might not be just allies. Maybe Monokuma is telling us to investigate that information on our own. Chiaki said she could not betray the Future Foundation. But if she were still alive, she definitely would have helped us. No. Even her, just being with us, would have been a big help. What should we do now? Well, that's obvious. If we're going to get out of here safely, we're going to have to get, or we're going to have to do that graduation exam, right? Oh, graduation exam, huh? I'm not really good at taking exams. Well, I guess it's better than people dying. Jeez. Monokuma said something about that, a field trip, right? He's telling us to investigate like we have been. Right. I'm going to do it. Like... Yeah, we must be able to learn something about Hope Sweet Academy ourselves. Uh... Uh, I don't care if we don't know anymore. If we just go back to our normal lives, I'm fine. Hey, we can go home when this is over, right? We can finally get off this damn island? If that's the case, let's all leave. This island alive by any means. Of course. Hell yes. He's right. Now's not the time to, to bemoan how unlucky I am. Where this place really is, what happened to Peak Academy, none of that matters. What's important is, I need to leave this island with the others. We sacrificed so many lives in order to survive, just so that we could do that. There's no way we can stop now, but... Monokuma already should already know that that's what we're thinking. So why did he say that? We have to decide on our own whether or not we leave Jagged Walk Island. He should already know we'd never choose to stay on the island. Hey, hey. So what are we going to do? Can we start already? Hmm. But what are we even looking for? Do we just have to investigate this weird-ass building? Even so. I don't think we'll find the answers to all of our questions inside the damn building. Ah, uh, uh, well, for now, I'm going to go ahead. Oh. Hey, you're already going? Jeez. What is this? that idiot thinking running around without caution, being cautious? She obviously isn't really thinking about anything. However, It'll be fine. There's no longer any situations where we must exchange each other's lives. So we should do our best as so we should do our best as well. Like they say, it is not scary if everyone stops at a green light. If we stopped at a green light, we'd never reach our goal. Jeez. Akane already took off on her own. It might be faster if we split up and look around too. Like Sonya said, if there's no more killing, I don't have to worry about anyone betraying us anymore. <laughs> then, let's get it over with and go home. I'll go ahead. See you guys later. With those brief words, Fuyuhiko left the gymnasium. I shall do my best to obtain a wonderful clue that'll be useful for everyone. Now then, please excuse me. Sonya took a deep bow and left the gymnasium. Oh, Miss Sonya. Hey, Sonya. Please don't leave me. I'll be in danger if I'm left alone. Kazuichi chased Sonya, who had just departed and left the gymnasium. I should hurry and start too. Just a bit more. Just a bit more and it's going to end. I can escape this nightmare and return to my usual peace, usual peaceful everyday life. The only thing that we can do is advance towards that hope. Even though I don't understand that and that a lot of horrifying things keep happening. For the sake of everyone who couldn't make it this far, I'm definitely going to go home. Investigation. Perfect! In the next episode of Danganronpa 2, Goodbye Despair, we are going to go ahead and do our investigations into this chapter honestly i do not know where we're headed but i am curious to see what's gonna happen see you guys then